Hello everyone, Carpacoin here. I hope your week has been amazing and I'm here with the mini art haul I talked about. So, the other day I bought some things at the dollar store, at the art supply store and at the school store with regular office supplies. So, at school I bought these ooh, these regular graphite pencils and it was and two big pens. The pencils are uh, Mars, Lumograph, 7B, 6B and 2B. And I don't know if you can see on camera but the lead is quite different. Yay. Also, um, I erase a lot and I love these Hotring Rapid Eraser B. And as, as we can I can barely, I can't bear, uh, excuse my English, I can barely find uh, these anymore here in Portugal. So, as they had it at school, I bought the smaller ones, the B30, and I bought the last big one, the B20. And I just love these erasers so much. <laughs> then, at the dollar store, I bought two white acrylic paints because I use too much white acrylic and I can afford to buy nice ones and one small black acrylic, you know, 80 cents <laughs> like not so expensive and I bought this thing, this spray bottle to spray my watercolors with a bit of water before trying to pick up some pigments also this ruler, this sparkly ruler, awesome, because, yeah, I'm in need for a of a, uh, I need a ruler for geometry class, and mine is meh. So, now with the fun part, I went to the <coughs> art supply store, and I bought this Hanne Mühle watercolor book, and I think it is super nice. It has this rubber band and I'm, I can't wait to open it. Uh, I bought as my favorite color pencil uh, from Viarco, which is a watercolor pencil. And I don't know if, it's if it is called purple, but it's a pinkish purple. So as I went to the art store, I bought a new one, although it is from... Uh, although it is a Creta, Creta color thing, Marino, I think, it is also a watercolor pencil and roughly in the same color. And I hope this one works as well as mine. I don't know. So, uh, as you might know, if you follow my Instagram account, I, I use Pro Markers quite often. often. And as such, I decided to try out the Copics. So I bought two Copic Chow, and I can't wait to try them. I bought the Cool Cha Cool Shadow and Pale Head, whatever that means. I bought this bought these two. One is a really pale pastel pink, and the other uh, the same in green. And I love watercolors and I was missing this pink which is, I don't know if you can see, probably not. It's a permanent rose, uh, Winter Newton Cotman and it is number 500, 502 and I bet it's awesome. So now to the best, best part, let's try this, this out. the pencil so this is the to be the 6b and the 7b 
awesome. Okay. Then the this one is a creta color purplish pinkish thing and I hope this one works. Oh, I like this color. It's not as purple as I thought it would be, but it's very nice. I think I'll need to buy another one because I don't believe this one is going to last me very long. Now, Copics. Let's see, this is the super brush side. Ooh, awesome. This is very light. I thought it would be darker because um, the pro markers, even if they say they're super light, they are usually a lot darker than they seem because, I don't know, they don't have many super light colors. So, ooh, this is nice. I hope this cool shadow is still as nice as this pink. Awesome. I love this minty green. I just never use it because I didn't have I I had never used it in an illustration because I don't I didn't have one in a pro marker or copic or anything. But so far I'm very happy with these colors and I can't wait to use them properly. Then here let's just open this thing this watercolor let's try this permanent rose awesome I've been wanting to buy this color for so long it is so awesome I love this color so much as you may have noticed, I do like pink a lot, and I'm already in love with this color. I'm gonna use it so much. It's gonna be so fun. I'm super excited to to use these whole these all these things, and I'm not going to open this right now because I want to finish my uh, my sketchbook, this one here, before, and I still have 20 pages left from the 98 it comes with but I can't wait to try this one this one too and when I open it uh, I think it would be nice to make a review to film a review and yes I think I'm gonna do it when I open this thing I'm gonna review this and I'm going to use this color because I love it and yes I'll try this with the colors I use the most maybe I'll do a color chart in the back I don't know well thank you for watching and see you next next week bye